The time is 11 o'clock on this late Wednesday night, June 28, 2017. It's time now for the Bear Channel. 11 o'clock news on this late Wednesday night, June 28, 2017. Good evening, everybody. I am Peter J. Wiggins. It's 11 o'clock. And our top story on the Peter Channel. 11 o'clock news is... Colonel George Pell of Australia... Who has a cardinal and any the Pope is charged with sexual assault. Mitch McConnell is trying to revive the Senate health care bill by Friday. Officials are finalizing the details of President Trump's partially resisted travel ban. The HS officials announced an anti security measures for all flights to US, but won't expand the laptop ban. Destruction of Arkansas's Ten Commandments is fundamentally placed a spotlight in the separation of church and state. US women church boyfriend and YouTube stun. After a helicopter attack, ministers asked, what was this about? South Korean leader defends the sin with Trump on North Korea. Father Baby Doe speaks to session she He was robbed his chance to be a dad to Bella. A little a mystery and an FBI agents have done with a messy aftermath or again stand off. No evidence and documented goods commit more crimes. Adabur is overbait with fireworks on July 3rd. Adabur superintendent gets a grade from school board. One of main breaks on Cutcaster Street in Foxburg. Adabur retakes control of contaminated Finnberg Field. Adabur teachers agree to a new contract. Adabur, one person was taken to a Rhode Island hospital in Providence after a motorcycle pickup truck collided Wednesday afternoon on Pleasant Street near Grinnell Road. Shrekles lowest column in a strange but breaks part of case against him. Fed gives big U.S. banks a green light for buyback dividend plans. Stables is dealt $6.9 billion in the new order at the Nuffield Battle. President Trump takes another swap at Amazon, saying business doesn't pay interest net taxes. Strange sea pickles keep washing shore in the Pacific Northwest and signs are baffled. Forty McBuffet says return from his nomination with Trover Data. After a day, will offer a crash course in another event on Space Rocks. With a better rain, Cressy Mars Rover picks his own targets. ACA Medicare expenses seen as going to cardiac arrest deaths. Babies need to be taken off last quarter after parents lose quarter appeal. All right, one minute ago, not bad night. We have to take the bridges of parking lot, sick alternate routes, heavy delays, and bust the messages in. Peter Jell News Time, 11.02 on this late. When they added it, coming out for traffic and turns it apart. Baby! Let's study off an MBT where Ashmont Station is close to the smoke from adjacent fires. Shuttle bus services provide a field score in Ashmont and on the Manaban line in Ashmont to Cedar Grove. Someone else went to switch with model laser to traffic. On the commuter rail, it's looking good on the ferry. They are looking good. Okay, looking at that, I was in byways of New England. 146 on the southbound side. Snow between Lincoln and Providence, Rhode Island. A little, little bit slow. 130 to the westbound side. Back up between the Newport Bridge and the James Stan Bridge. Route 3 on the southbound side. A little start to stop central Plymouth, Massachusetts. 93 on the southbound side. It's backed up after the Safari Expressway. After the Mass Pack, all the way down to Dorchester. Mass Pack, westbound side. A little slow between Safari Expressway, all the way down to Yalta Bat Tolls. And 93, it's Backed up between the Zaken Bridge all the way down to Selwyn Square and Somerville. So it's six of the alternate routes. Route 1 on the northbound side. Slow between 16 and Everett North Valley to Route 16 Revere. 120 on the northbound side. Back up between Route 95 and Everett Peabody. Route 45 on the southbound side. Back up at Route 3 in Chelmsford. Mass back and westbound side. Slow after 295 in Auburn. And 95 on the northbound and southbound side. The also around the old Sabre stretch and... Very much, Nerf Jermaine, I was off. Looking good. Peter Chill News on. 11.04 on this late Wednesday night, and it's coming out for a weather report, and it turned out to be a wonderful Wednesday in the weather department, and it turned out to be perfect weather for the duck race at Fulton's Pond in Mansfield. Nothing brewing on the radar lately? Okay. For the night, Patch of at 2 a.m. West, increased clouds about 36 degrees. Light southwest wind, Thursday, Patch of 7 a.m. West, Patch of Sunday, with a rising humidity of about 81 degrees. Light southwest wind about 30 miles away, and a gust of 24 miles an hour. Thursday night, chance of showers with thunderstorms and possible at 2 a.m. Mostly clouds about 66 degrees. Southwest wind about 
10 miles of gust light, 30 miles an hour, chest patient, 30%, riding foot to chest flat, 85 degrees, southwest west, 9 0, 11 miles an hour, Friday night, slight tissue showers and thunderstorms between 10 p.m. and 1 a.m. Mostly gust cover, a little bit, 68 degrees, southwest west, 7 to 10 miles of chest patient, 20%. Saturday, most of the night's with 85 degrees. Second night, at Chester Shadows and Thunderstorms after 1 a.m. Punch back after 5 a.m. Mostly Cosco at about 68 degrees. Chester Patient, 30%. For Sunday, Chester Shadows and Thunderstorms before 7 a.m. Then, Shadows Lock of a Possible Thunderstorm between 7 and 11 a.m. Then, at Chester Shadows and Thunderstorms after 11 a.m. Punch back before 8 a.m. Otherwise, mostly Cosco at 82 degrees. Chester Patient, 6 percent Sunday night, Punch back after 3 a.m. Otherwise, mostly Cosco at 65 degrees. Monday, most of the Sunday, the podcast is about 86, about 63 degrees. And for Wednesday, most of the Sunday, most of the podcast is about 83, about 63 degrees. And for Wednesday, Chet to shout and done so and put success but say hungry then chest page to 30 percent currently in total in its first guys and it's 66 and not in its first guys and we have a temperature of 59 and men's field its first guys and we have 57 and that's coming up by the Peter channel 11 o'clock news on this late one at 20 june 2017 i appear to you so if you have a good evening goodbye to you and i'll see you tomorrow morning more for y'all have a good night